Sierra Club 13, intersection of Ember, ready for departure, runway 19, VFR for the north training area. Maybe. Sierra Club 13, Echo and Tower, runway 19 at November, wind 1108, cleared for takeoff. Sierra Club 13, cleared for takeoff, 19 at November. The altimeter is 3015. Uh, okay. Good. Oh, here comes some of that stuff they're talking about. Okay, we are aligned to one nine. Ready? Ready. Feet on the floor. Air speed's alive. Yeah, going to rotate. That thing's lagging. It felt like we we're going way fast. Maybe a little moisture in the system, even though it was under cover. Get to 76. Tighten the turn a little, you're gonna go over the other runway. There you go. And we're looking for 106 inbound, right? Yes, sir. I guess it's just been a while since I've been in this one. This, this one actually had that little rumble in it every once in a while. Uh, well, I'm turn that a little bit. Army 72346, contact Pensacola, approach 119 or point zero CN. 119.0 for 72.346. Yeah, we're down to 84 knots. Probably going to slow down some more. Attention to it. Yeah, I'll, I mean, I'll navigate. I'll, I'll try to listen. Yeah, I'll try. I'll listen for it, or I'll try to uh, feel it. Maybe because we got your heels up, I got my feet flat on the floor, and I can feel it occasionally. That could be it. But I've actually heard it before. We haven't Plenty figured out what's traffic, doing it. Traffic, many eight two five eight six whiskey two mile final right, four zero. Can you feel that? Here we went. Eight six. Yeah, I feel it now. I'm looking for the shoulder. Thank you. See how far out you got there? Or you just want to go back to it um, and start over? Uh, yeah, well, a little bit. I'm not even, it's not even lighting up yet. Yeah. I'm not even, and I'm checking this to see how far off I am. And I'm right about there. And I need to get over there. To. Oh, well, that, uh, swinging it wide enough, I should have been 30 degrees. Well, you were further out. Remember you had a tail when you were doing probably 130 knots outbound. Eight zero two, you cleared to crash. The old northwest has published maintained six thousand. Oh boy, yeah. who was that? Eight zero.
you set this thing to the ILS, do you have to turn it to get it to line up straight? Negative. It auto goes to that sensitivity and will give you the localizer without having that lined up, but you want to turn it just for situational awareness to... Okay. I was wondering why you did that. I was like, that's the ILS, what's he doing? Sort of like a hitting bug, you know. That's one reason... If you move that to the localizer for the hitting bug, which probably well should have it on 216 right now, or you go into the localizer because you know you're going to get that in a minute. You know, when we did our first flight, the other airplane doesn't have it, so that's probably why we didn't do it. And when you got with Jason, he'd come up with it because it, this is the only one that has one, 172 anyway. Which is a good thing. Yeah, I like them. You did, you did say 210, right? 216. 216. A little to the right. Well, you got wind, so it's not hurting you much, but just go ahead and hold 216. Intercept localizer flight inbound. And if you look, we're kind of painting the little procedure turn. Okay. To get you around there. Just trying to mirror that, because that's kind of what they'll be giving you. Or if you flew it off the chart, you'd be making that, flying that hitting. I'm never finding the localizer. With the lens. Uh, there it goes. And you're clear left when the time comes. Clear left when the time comes. Yeah. I would probably go ahead and start, because you're going to overfly it if you don't. <laughs> hint, hint. And remember, the winds are going to be... A little bit more over to the left. Slightly. Yep, it's not that big a cut. This is a little bit more sensitive, so just keep an eye on it. There you go. Ah, uh, guess what? So everything should be about matching up. Try to do four radar contact four miles northwest of Duke, flying three six zero. Well, that's a lot better signal than the one we across the other way. So you're where? Final approach fix. Final approach fix three point nine from the runway. Alrighty. Confirm. Just gonna stay right on it. Yeah, look at your ground speed now. The winds are really playing with you. And actually, the autopilot would track that for you, too. <laughs> yeah, we haven't played with that in a while. But we don't need to do that now. We'll get your hand flying, get you back in the game. Should be about 500 feet a minute descent. Yeah, yeah. yeah it should be doing about 90 knots, so you can't way too much power for this. He's about 2,000 RPM. Go ahead and pitch up a little bit so you don't drop. Back over to the right. Yep. Yeah. Well, left a little. There you go. ballpark of the airspeed and when you start down it should be able to hold right around 100 with 2,000 RPM and yeah I don't know if you're getting kicked around you're actually letting it turn I feel you're getting kicked three-quarter deflection would probably oh you saved it and I hold on to it there we go it's better a little bit to the... ah, when you get a chance go ahead and flip the foggles yeah. up yeah, yeah, minimum. it's a little too damn windy for me to let you go all the way down to that's close enough two something all righty 
No flap landing out of the uh, wind check. Wind 130 at 12. Thanks. Yeah, you remember when you go wind check at wind check 19? Because they're different. <laughs> you would hope you would know who was calling it, but. Alright, let's slow it down. We're going way fast here. Okay, make sure the barrier was down. Yeah, it is. But I still had it slowing down more. Alright, get the rut. Push it around and hold that left wing into it. And my rudder right, right. There you go. Hold it right there. And easy. We're going to have to lose some. Airport 1 3, table left turn, taxi, contact coming up. Yeah, hey, we're not down yet. Power's at idle. Power's at idle. Alright, just kind of hold the elevator. Don't hold it back. Hold it back neutral. So that. Got some steering. I'm gonna get my feet out of your way. All right, now you can see if we can get on the brake slightly and turn off here at Julia. Yeah, Julia, I got it. But we gotta be careful with these stripes because it'll slide. There, but one three uh, left turn when able. Contact ground one. Eric, one three. Yeah, we missed the first call, but I was worrying about letting you drive the airplane more than yelling. A little bit. Always lighter. fly first. Yeah. All right. Cool. Well, it's so big, so.